Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to Van Cleef and Arpels to browse some of their jewelry. Let's go! So I wanted to look at a few pieces of jewellery, maybe either a necklace, ring or bracelet. I have not decided yet. Here I'm looking at a few necklaces made out of 100% gold or diamonds. Compared to some of the other Van Cleef stones, full diamond or full gold are a bit easier to take care of. So these necklaces are from the Alhambra and Byzantine collection. I'm also interested to look at pieces in onyx. I really like the color contrast of the stone against the yellow gold. I would say onyx and carnelian which is the red stone is a bit more hard wearing compared to some others. So here we have the necklace in the vintage size. We also have the five motif bracelet and the ring with the diamond in the center. So here we have the vintage size necklace in the malachite, which is the green stone and white mother of pearl. BCA stones are uncoded, so if you get really fragile stones like this one damaged, you would have to get them repaired and it costs about $300 or so to get them repaired for each particular stone. The SA recommended that you take off your pieces uh, before showering or before going to the pool and not to expose them to chemicals or soap. So for the bracelets, you could size them up or size them down. Normally they come in about 17 centimeters. But you could size them down as far as 16 centimeters or as big as 20 centimeters at any time.
While I'm in the store, the SA was really kind and nice enough to show me other pieces from other collections. So she's going to show me a few timepieces. This is the Lady Arpels watch. So we have three different variations of the watch with interchangeable strap. Prices are on the website, so this retails for about 560 Malaysian ringgits, so depending on the design, or so that's about 100,000 or more US dollars. This watch is ideal for ladies who are out on events, but it's not suitable for day-to-day -day wear. What's unique about this particular piece is it has this animation, as you can see, with the two couples coming to the center and kissing and then going back to its original position. I'm going to show you some of my favorite designs from Van Cleef and Arpels. This is the Between the Finger Rings. This one in the double butterfly with rubies and diamonds. I think it looks really pretty and really unique. There are variations as well with aquamarine, lapis azuli and other stones. This one is the Alhambra Between the Finger Ring and this one in Malachite. Because of its open design, the ring is pretty flexible and as you can see here, it looks very nice on my essay's hand. Thanks for watching, hope you liked today's video, don't forget to hit like and subscribe in I Look Book and Lifestyle. See you soon, bye bye.